Welcome to Decoding for Kids. In this video, we are going to play NASA Space Jam game. In this game, we are going to create a solar system using code blocks. And also, we will program planets to make music. NASA Space Jam is nothing but the mix of planets, music, solar system and astronomy. And that's why they have named it as Space Jam. At the end, you will be able to create your own solar system. Now, let's see step 5 to 8 in this video. Okay, guys, this is lesson 5. Pluck a string. Here, the instructions given is, create and draw a string by placing the create string and draw string blocks in the right positions. If you place the if planet block within the loop block, it will keep changing to see if a plane planet has crossed the string. So in the workspace, if you see, they have already placed the previous blocks over here. I mean the background star and the planet that you have created previously. So now we are going to create a string. So I am placing a create string block inside the setup block. If you want, you can change your string color and the angle. Yeah, next I'm placing the draw string block inside the loop. And again I'm placing the if planet crosses string inside the loop. And inside the if planet crosses string, I'm placing the pluck string block. So when the planet crosses the string, you will hear a pluck string sound. So now I'm clicking the run button. Yeah, you can see a string and the sound is created. Click continue to go to the next lesson. Yeah, this is lesson 6. Lesson 6 is play drums. And the instructions given is place the set planet drum block within the create planet block to set a drum sound for that planet. Place the play planet drum block in the right spot so that you will hear the drum when a planet crosses the string. So if you see here, already the string is placed on the left side. Now we are going to create a drum sound when your planet crosses the string. So I am placing the set planet drum block inside the create planet block. And you can change the sound to whatever you want. And I'm placing the play planet drum block inside the if planet process string. So now if you click the run button, you can see the planet crossing the string and you will hear the drum sound. Now that's it guys, lesson 6 is completed. Click continue to go to the next lesson. Yeah, this is lesson 7. Lesson 7 is play notes. Place the set planet note block within the create planet block to set a particular note to that planet. You can use the set planet note instead of if you could use the notes from a certain scale. So in the previous lesson, if you see when the planet is crossing the string, you heard a drum sound. In this, you are going to replace the drum sound by some notes, some musical notes. So I am placing the set planet note inside the create planet block and you can change the notes to what you want. And I am placing the play planet note inside the if planet causes string block. So if you click the run button, you can see the note playing. Now I am clicking the stop button, give clip playing and the second step is you can use the set planet note instead if you would like to choose notes from a certain scale. Here they have added a new block which is the scale. So I am replacing this block with the set planet note scale block. 
so you can change your scale to what you want and you can change the note also so if you want you can create one more planet and you can change the size so it and the angle also and same way I'm placing this set planet note block over here if you click the run button you can see two planets with two different nodes yeah you can hear two different nodes I mean two different musics yeah that's it you can go to the next lesson this is lesson 8 this is create your own space jam Combine planets with drums and notes to create your own planetary symphony. You can also add multiple strings. So you are going to create your own planetary symphony. So for that you can, cre you can create as how many planets you want. So now I am creating three planets. And I am placing the set planet drum block here inside the first planet created then set planet note inside the second planet and set planet note scale inside the third planet and you are going to change the size of all the planets <coughs> and the period also you can change to whatever you want angle also you can change yeah now we are going to change the background and I'm going I'm also going to change the star color size of the star your string color and your string angle yeah that's it now if you click the run button you can see your own planetary symphony <coughs> Yeah, that's it guys. This is the planetary that I have created. You can choose your own. I think it looks good. Okay guys, see you all in another video. Thanks for watching.